Hey y'all, welcome into the channel. I hope everybody's having a good day. You guys, we're going to start it off with an affirmation. Welcome into the Chosen Ones reading. Okay, your pop-up postcard reading. It's your pop-up postcard message for the Chosen. The Golden Child. Sorry, the Golden Child. Okay, Golden Child, you need to know. Hello, Wednesday. Okay, something significant about Wednesday for you. I feel like the day you're viewing this, okay, um, you're going to be warming up or things are warming up. You're going to be feeling very create creative very innovative okay you're going to be feeling like um more i feel like playful you're going to be feeling like having fun exploring discovering and creating okay um you could be uh experiencing or i feel like enjoying some chill time okay some downtime all right and the more of this um downtime or chill time that you take for yourself the more imaginative you can be the more creative and inspirational you can be okay so your affirmation for this card is i am creative okay i am creative i feel like you're just gonna feel more on fire you could even just feel more passionate you could just feel more alive you could just feel more aware more vigilant okay more alert more on point more on your game you could just feel more bossed up you could just feel more um you know feeling yourself you could just be feeling feeling you could feel more you could be feeling more okay all right i feel like when people see you you turn heads but i feel like your energy it's not so much about your the physicalness of you it could be a, like i don't know the way you wear your hair the way you speak okay um your walk your smile is significant your your eyes you have a significant look of gaze about you um i feel like it's more with someone there it's more than just sex okay it's more than that it's it's more this person my right ear is itching this person this person is attracted to you because of your essence okay it's your internal maternal it's your nature it's the rise that you give this person um the rise the rise you rise okay it's like you lift you encourage or inspire you motivate it's something you out here doing that through your creativity you're motivating or you're inspiring someone else to be creative okay um i feel like people get around you and they they like oh i gotta let me do better <laughs> like not not because of anything that you said but more so of your moves like your plays the way that you resonate the way that you you grace or you you grace a room it's like your presence is noticed like you are you're this energy that's basically like yeah i'm i'm here i'm here and your presence it it is pressure you you pressurize the cabin you 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 cause people to rise it's like you have people have to rise to meet you people might stand to greet you but i feel like like whoever you're in a relationship with, they're extremely chivalrous. I see this person opening doors, closing doors, carrying bags, like doing all the heavy lifting. Okay. Like that, you don't do none of that. Okay. Um, I see that. All right. They do it because they love you, but they also do it because it's a queen or it's a status that they recognize a queendom, a goddess. There's something highnessness about you that they recognize okay and it's a level where like they have to rise to meet you because i don't see you stooping to the level of anyone i'm like I, i'm like i see you being like look uh this is where i am i see where you're at but um let's do the work to get you here okay um because i don't even feel like an energy of like like you're trying to be snooty or trying to be whatever but it's a vibe where you're that's your goal like god it's your gift your gift is to cause other people to rise to meet their purpose because you've met your purpose you're meeting your purpose someone here is meeting their quota at work okay it's like i met my quota at work uh what y'all what y'all doing you know what i mean like or i i did what i nurtured whatever part of the project i was working on where's your part your part um i've met I've met if my if the 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 rules where I had to rise, you know, 
I ha okay, somebody's go somebody's losing weight because she said a flat belly. So maybe it's like this is like okay, my six hundred pound life, and someone's like, look, you need to meet this amount of weight loss before you can have the surgery. Okay, it's like you met that. Now you're looking at them like now you do do what you promise. Now it's to the point where like you're looking like okay, it's time for you to do your play your part. Play, do what you're supposed to as this divine feminine or as this divine masculine, whatever role you're connecting yourself with at this moment. It's like connect with it and then do your role as well. And I feel like your energy commands that, not because of something that you say, but because of your presence when you grace a damn room. You demand nothing but the best because you require it for yourself, because you hold it within yourself, because you resonate at that frequency within yourself. That means uh, you don't surround yourself with just anybody because you're not just anybody. And you know that. Yes, it's that vibe. I like it. All right, I like it. So maybe things are heating up because people are trying to match your energy. Okay. I get that vibe too. It's like they're trying to match your energy. A business plan. So they, they could have came up with a new business plan. Okay. She said a business plan. Okay. So I don't know why I'm getting black eyed peas off of this, but I did. Like maybe you need to eat some black eyed peas. Black eyed peas speak about prosperity. Okay, um, that you could have prosperity in your energy. Maybe you already ate these black eyed peas. Okay, you about to all of a sudden see some money come through. All right, it's like because it's in your energy, it's in your body. Your body is your energy. Okay, and it's like whatever you're feeding your temple will manifest in the physical realm. So basically, if you've been eating a lot of greens, you know what I'm saying, you're gonna get a lot of cash. But this black eyed peas, this talks about like you know peas. It goes deeper. It's a deeper type of wealth. So this could be maybe like a deeper type of even healing because this is actually the lapis. Zuli. So maybe this is talking about like a deeper type of healing, spiritual connectedness uh, to go around. You're going to have more to go around. Okay. So rose quartz energy and the rose quartz. All right. The rose quartz energy speaks about compassion and love and, you know, just a softening, a sensitive sensitivity. This is Neptune. King Neptune energy right now. So this is more of you being in the present. Okay. You're going to be able to be more in the present because you've basically, it's like, you're going to have enough um, to give. You're going to have more to give, but you're going to be able to stay more in the present because you wrapped up things of the past, okay? Um, there's an energy where you block things out from the past. It's like you're only paying attention to uh, positivity. That's what it is. Because you're not, you're causing, you're not focused on nothing low vibrational. You're like, look, I'm going to the top, okay? Like, I, I have a plan. You got a real plan here. Okay, you could be, um, you're going to be giving birth, I'm seeing a placenta. Lungs could be significant. I'm also seeing an urn, but this is the type of urn. Oh, this give me that song. I know what this is. This is that song, Rumors, by... This is that song by um Lizzo, Rumors. Okay, featuring Cardi B. She's like, all the rumors are true, yeah. Okay, whatever you say, yeah. But I think you're like, you're not paying attention to none of that. You're like, yep, all that, mm-hmm. Maybe somebody's trying to lose weight. Because they're talking about the food pyramid. And then the flat belly. I don't know, okay? Maybe you recently lost a lot of weight. Maybe the lo the weight loss is going to be like the, you know what I mean? The get back, like, yeah, whatever y'all was saying, boom, now look at me now. Like, somebody's getting a makeover. Maybe your body got upgraded, okay? So now people have no choice but to meet you where you are. Like, you, you're, I don't know, not like a body upgrade in the physical, like not any type of work. I've never had any type of 
surgeries done to my breasts, my boobs, my butt, my stomach. I've never done none of that. My lips, my face, none of that. I'm all 100%. <laughs> so I feel like you haven't either. But I feel like it's something like... So the holidays are coming up. And they're like, enjoy yourself. But there's an energy of weight being... Maybe they... I feel like because you're not in a sunken place or you're not in a place where you feel bad or you're trying to hide anything or it's like none of that. This weight is that whatever that weight is or was, it falls off because, see, some of us can eat to soothe. This says 600 pound life energy. But it's like you're not doing someone's healed on an emotional level to where they're not doing things in the physical anymore that were affecting them because of some type of emotional trigger. OK, uh, from the past. So that's what I'm getting for you. It's like something in your space was cleared. You could have marble counters. OK, or you could be thinking about getting marble counters in your home. OK. Granted, I'm sorry, granted marble, but the marble one, the one that looks like this. Okay, you could be like wanting that in your house. Okay, the light marble. I don't know what they call it, but you could be desiring that or you have that already in your home or your bathroom. Okay, I'm seeing a bathroom counter, a kitchen counter. All right. Stones. Stones are very, very significant stones okay so you're in the stone passage as well you're about to start to receive cosmic communication because you're no longer bogged down by what's not serving you you separated yourself there could have been three people you and your partner separated yourselves from like yeah no we're not we don't we don't kick it with them okay we don't kick it with them or we don't we don't associate ourselves with that or this could have been in the workplace you're like yeah no i don't i don't i don't work for them so i'm not going to hang with them or i don't you know they don't cut my paycheck so i don't have to i don't have to be friends i'm just here to be i can be cordial but we don't got to be buddy buddy okay i don't know it's something like that okay but it's you separated yourself but in separating yourself you pulled someone's card like you you make i don't even think you do it's not on purpose this is not intentional that's why i'm having the hardest time trying to figure it out maybe somebody trying to figure your ass out and you're like look i'm just me i'm creative i just move i just do what i do like i'm a free it's giving me free spirit vibe like you just move how you move you meditate she said you meditate you could meditate you know what i'm saying and it's like it helps you meditation helps you be creative Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. All right. Maybe you need to meditate. If you're lacking creativity, try meditation, try yoga, try sitting still. If you're having a hard time being in the here and now, if you find yourself, you know, I don't know. Maybe because I feel like you felt isolated by others. So sometimes you can tend to isolate yourself as a, as a protective thing, but I feel like in doing so, I don't think it's nothing wrong with the way you're doing it, though, because you're leveling up. I'm saying this because, y'all, I'm getting all of this off of this energy of these dang crayons, right? Or these these color pencils, okay? It's like two of these color pencils are up, okay? They up, all right? And if I'm going by the colors of my horses, which are my knights in my new deck, the sidebar, LOL, then this is going to be the knight of pentacles, and this purple one is going to be the knight of wands, okay? So it's like an earth sign and a fire sign that have leveled up in some type of way. And it's caused some other energies that connect with this color red it could be a fire sign um a, two fire signs and a air sign possibly um th this could be people you work with people in your family okay that are kind of like feeling maybe it's a threat somebody feels threatened damn i feel like i went through a lot to get that out your reading was long as hell just to get to that point someone was threatened by your creativity 
It said perfect. Whew, thank you. Because, Lord, I was like, Spirit, what are you trying to tell this golden child right here? Okay, so basically, here's your postcard pop-up. Okay, and then let me see who is this. I'm going to read this card. But first, let me see what the heck is going on here. So, the goon, the, uh, the Ogun, okay? It's, this, this is the West uh, Africa energy okay africa all right these are ancestors from the orishans okay if you're walking with my journey i connect with the africans through the orishans okay so it's like uh knowledge from sirius you're about to receive knowledge from sirius okay a sweet kick okay so i feel like that's that level up energy okay this will be an unknown language oh they're going to communicate with you by way of an unknown language okay but you will understand it okay it's going to be like a cosmic conversation um with the dragon okay um Yes, this is really weird because this happened yesterday. Whoa. So you're about to come out riding on alligators. Okay. 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 Something just clicked for me, y'all. So excuse me. But basically, it's like you are about to have a conversation with the dragon. Okay. And when you meet the dragon, so imagine having a conversation with a fire-breathing dragon, okay? And the dragon's like, um, they're not blowing out their fire, though. They're just, they're just talking to you, okay? And this dragon looks more like a snake, okay? Um, to be honest, all right, if I'm honest. And the snake is talking to you, and the snake is like, um, I can't. Like, all of a sudden, you see the snake walk away, and you're like, where are you going? Um, or you see the dragon walk away and you're like, where are you going? And this dragon is like, I can't, I can't do anything with you. Um, I can't harm you any longer. You are too healed. Okay. So imagine that this dragon is on the postcard, a live postcard, y'all. Okay. This one's a live version. All right. And they're like, I can't, I can't harm you anymore. You're already, you're already too healed. Okay. So you've reached the level of healing. I feel like the, the remedy that you've come up with, which was to, did I pull who you were? Did I pull who you were? I didn't, but I feel like the remedy that you've come up with to be able to, um, give me the word spirit. To protect yourself, I feel okay, um, and 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 honor the code. I feel like you've you've learned. This is hermit energy. You've learned to go in. You learn to go in, focus on your creations, and then come back out when when God says. You know what I'm saying? And when going in and you're focusing on creations, I felt like you could have been tempted by something or someone, and I feel like you 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 were armored up. You were armored up. Okay. You were suited up, um, booted up, whatever, whatever. Like you were in an energy that now allows you to be more creative and chill. Okay. I feel like you don't have to be on guard anymore. Okay. Um, you don't have to be armored up in a sense where in the defense, you can play some offense now offense you get to go out there and play you get to go out there and show your skill you get to go out there and stretch your legs okay uh, you get to go out there and, and, sh and show them hands okay scorpio all right and so i feel like that's the vibe it's like you get to come out now and the song for you is no flex song Okay, I feel like they know not to come in your area there is that division that is that level of separation where your frequency you're in another frequency or something like that. Okay, Scorpio? They can't touch you where you at. They can't reach you. They have to raise, they got to raise their standards to meet you. You cause people to raise their standards. Look over their morals. I feel like you cause people to think about life. You be having some deep ass conversations, Scorpio. You kind of get a motherfucker lost. I ain't going to lie to you. <laughs> but this has been your reading, Scorpio. I love you. And I'll see you guys next time. All right. I hope you enjoyed this pop-up reading, pop-up pop postcard reading for the chosen, the golden Scorpio. Okay. The golden child, Scorpio. This has been it. 122 on the clock. Love y'all. Bye.